I get along with everyone. Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and welcome back to Blue Plays Dragon's Dogma 2. We're back in Vernworth at long last, and we have some news for Brent. We were also just met with some individuals telling us to meet someone in the tavern at night, but they wouldn't tell us who it was because, frankly, according to them, they didn't know. Now, it very well could be Brent, or it might be someone else. Now, I am going to go ahead and sit on this bench actually right here and wait for evening and then go check the tavern but then I do want to try and work on some of these other side quests that I have that I've been sitting in my inventory for some time because I don't want to lose out on them if at all possible let's go ahead and take a look at the quests so we need to take a look at our pursuer I don't even know who this person is but hopefully Silverius does I don't know if we've been the tenant of Mildred's home for a week but we might as well check in um, okay, watch the beggar. So this is the individual in front of the fountain. We still need to figure out where he goes during the day or I guess during night. And then Heart Village, we can return there and hopefully since it's been a few days. Uh, and I guess there was a port crystal that I could have activated there. So that's a shame. And then the ornate box. Sven still wants to pay us back even though he gave us that wonderful fruit wine. Okay, but it is evening. So let's see what is the best way to go. I guess this way. <laughs> Just leaping right over. Perhaps new discovery. There is much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. Have you divined aught of the false sovereign, your majesty? This appears to be a bill calling for the arrest of a man named Dara. But hold a moment. Does this man's countenance not bear an uncanny resemblance to that of the false sovereign? Hmm. I see. If your majesty is certain that the two are one and the same, then I am convinced as well. However, I'm afraid this paper alone does not constitute sufficient proof. Ah, but of course. I surmise your majesty intends to post the bill and invite suspicion. I do now. A clever plan. The Queen Regent will be forced to deny any connection to our new sovereign, yet will be unable to remove the bill from the public eye. Furthermore, it will serve as an attestation to Dara's existence, which shall remain an undeniable truth till the man resurfaces. And all the while, the doubts lurking in the hearts of the citizenry will continue to deepen. A clever ploy indeed. I shall attend to this matter personally. I have no doubt that this bill would prove its worth in due course. You have my gratitude, your majesty. Your aid has been invaluable. That thief is a capable sort. Dragon's gaze. For the Queen Regent. Hmm. What, pray tell, is that item? If you use the item known as the Dragon's Gaze, Wakestone Shards will be displayed on your map. Bear in mind, however, that the number and location of shards that can be found will change over time. So I just have to use it? Okay, is that throughout the land or is it just in this area? And is that, is it gone now? No, it's still there, okay. Well, that's kind of cool, I guess. I don't know that I really need Wakestone shards. We last saw the young man who coveted that ornate box. Mayhap we ought to seek him out. I agree. Thank you very much, Severius, for mentioning Sven. Let's see what he's up to these days. Lead the way. Our road was a long one. Do you shop often? Sven, it's, Sven, it's me. I'm rather unfamiliar with the market, as twere. Is it because it needs to be morning? All right, we'll set it to morning. Probably safer to do that anyway. Oh, and look at that. Mildred's Week of Wandering is up. Fantastic. Oh, the timing is just great. All right, first, Sven, you're still sitting there. Again, 
truth be told, I was hoping we might. Would you care to stay and talk a moment? Is this the equivalent of stay a while and listen? I'm glad. But sit down, won't you? I'm rather fond of this place. I never imagined a city could be like this. So full of excitement, so alive. And how could I have? In all my life, I've hardly left the palace. My mother is quite strict. You understand. Oft did I long for a taste of normal life. Even aught as simple as going shopping for myself. My mother has always procured the things I covet for me, so to pick out an item and obtain it with my own hands held a certain appeal. Of course, in the end, you were the one who made the purchase. That's all right. I know you meant well. Besides, I can safely say it was still a novel experience. I wanted to give you something in return by way of thanks. Here, this is for you. Is it photographic proof of your mother's undeniable guilt? My apologies, friend, but I'd best be going. I mustn't let mother find out I left the palace. Thank you for indulging me. I, I do hope we'll see each other anon. Till then, farewell. I like Sven as a character. You gave me a Jasper. Okay, sure. Nothing wrong with that. It seems like those might just be for selling. I'm guessing. It was a fascinating tale those soldiers outside the palace were discussing. Regarding the Queen Regent and an important personage, you mean? Aye. Tell is, her ties to this figure from the neighboring country have a romantic tint. <laughs> what was that noise, Silverius? Look at you getting involved in rumors. Okay, so hopefully that quest is going to update at some point because... Receive recompense. I did. Well, hopefully that will change. But let's go ahead and... Change it to a place to call home. A full week has passed since Sir Mildred set off. I suppose it is time we vacated her dwelling. Well, we'll see. I would love that. Go ahead, Silverius. The guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. Good. We're here. Good tidings, friend. Oh, Silverius, chill, chill, chill. As for me. I made the most of my week-long sojourn. One might even say I enjoyed myself over much. You see, I grew so fond of the destination my feet carried me off to, methinks I should like to live there. And that's when I thought, mayhap you've grown just as fond of this dwelling. Fond enough to purchase it from me? Ooh. Funds are a little tight right now. I can't just give it to you, mind. I've my relocation costs to consider. But I'd sell it to you cheap as I can afford. Well, friend, what say you? 20,000 doesn't seem terrible. I think we could get that pretty quickly. Sorry, I am to hear it. You know where to find me, should you change your mind. All right, that seems, that seems completely fair. I think we shall, I think we shall. Okay. And ornate box is still there. Let's check out the beggar's tale and see if Silverius has some info for us. Gather round, gather round. Treat your ears to a tale by a master storyteller. Silverius, anything coming to uh, coming to mind? appreciate a coin or two to save my throat. Anything? Now, listen close as today. Okay, he's going to tell the might or the Medusa. Curative is needed, master. You'll never fall it. Nothing to report, I'm afraid. Hmm. Ooh. What if I went to the oracle? Tis a ladder. Shall we see where it leads? No, we've been up most of these ladders. Where is the oracle here? Yeah, let's let's go check out the oracle. Arisen. 
I don't know if it'll change depending on what quest I have set as priority, but I just, I really want to figure this out. Let's see if this isn't something that we can do. Greetings. You need only make a worthy offering in exchange. I have seen your path. My Consider thy path with a cautious eye and an open mind, lest the light of revelation forsake thee. My gratitude. What if I do it again? I have seen your path. Same thing. You've my gratitude. Tis lovely to see you. Hmm. I don't know if that... Oh, wait a minute. Are you the person who's been following me? Look, master, a treasure chest. Hold on, hold on. You have to find a way to reach it. Yeah, you. Hmm. Bermudo. Get... Is no more this your box? What one might have expected. We cannot expect gleaming treasures round every corner. I don't trust you. Then again, you look kind of like this guy too. All right, fine. So it's not you. All right, well, let's try another side quest. This, I imagine, will probably let me know when it's ready. But let's try the Arisen's Shadow. And see if Silverius wants to say anything about this. And he doesn't. That's unfortunate. Okay, I mean, we can go talk to Brant. Could go talk to Brant some more. What was that sound? Well, sorry, Higgs. I was just curious. Hmm. Gather round, gather round. I got some coins. Just much appreciated. I wonder if I just have to keep paying him. That'd be silly, right? I got some coins. Much appreciated. I mean, this is this is obviously how he's making it. Is that a Seeker's token? Yes, it is. Interesting. I shall have to inform my own master of this. All right. Well, I guess it's time to go talk to Brant, who is not, of course, there, which just makes sense because you know. He likes to meet us at night. Welcome to the Star Drop Inn. We serve all manner of fine ales here. Shall I pour you a Buy a round for 2000 Sit back, relax, and enjoy the finest brews in all... Let's buy everyone a round. No one's here. <laughs> I just bought a round for an empty bar. And I'm cheersing myself. No one really cared. Uh, what about talking to the bard? This shows far from over. I mean, it really is an empty bar. All right, let's let's pass the time to, the to get Brant here, and then maybe we'll buy another round. See what happens. Come back anytime. There's Brant. There's. Nope, it's just us. Never mind. We're not gonna buy another round. There is much we ought to tend to. If All right, rumors about a large shore. I bear word from Regent Ken Sven, Your Majesty. He espied the delivery of a suspicious package to a man named Allard, a minister who happens to be one of the Queen Regent's staunchest and most powerful allies in the palace. From the pains he took to remain on scene, it is plain that Allard wished this delivery kept away from prying eyes. That alone is reason to suspect a connection to Deezer's schemes. We must get to the bottom of it. The Regent Kin intends to call Allard to his chambers come nightfall. 
He bids you to use this opportunity to search the minister's chambers and see if there's aught to be learned. What say you, your majesty? Are you willing to undertake this task? I shall ensure that the door to the minister's chambers is open between midnight and dawn. Pray. Use that time to infiltrate and uncover aught worthy of suspicion. This task is our responsibility. All right, this is another one where it claims I have to sneak and I very clearly don't have to. Wait, this guy's already gone? Where did he go? It's not even, it's not even dark. Where, where would he have gone? Oh, I wish I could keep track of him. There's a ladder here. What do you sell, by the way? Just kidding, you don't sell anything. I don't know how long the days last in Dragon Sagma, but I feel like I'm actually going to have to sit and watch for an entire day just to see when that beggar leaves. I mean, I could head to the... Sl Do you think he's in the slums? Hold on. Maybe he's in the slums. Sorry. I'm just thinking out loud here. We're going to go to... A Beggar's Tale. Yeah, see, there's no details. But he's not on the map now. So where the slums? Slums are... East of here. Maybe, maybe Walter's Tavern would have something. And where am I exactly? Oh, very, very close. Okay. So this wall right here is what separate... Mildred, I don't have your money yet, sorry. What? What? Should I have done this? Oh! My, my. I'm trapped like a rat in a cage. This arisen's both shrewd and fleet of foot. I really did have to grab him. That's hilarious. It's like catching the thief in Cassardus in the first. Oh, tis obvious, no? I am an agent of a sort. Let's just say there are some who don't want you wandering about as you please. I was to report on your comings and goings, you see. But I suppose that job's over, now you've found me out. So, how about it, friend? Will you let me go? I've no reason to trouble you any further. Aye, aye. You'll have your coin. That's how this works, isn't it? I, shouldn't I have demanded information, not payment? What if I refuse his gold? Will he give me info instead? Greed will get you nowhere, friend. But worry not. Uh oh. You won't need it where you're headed. Oh. What is happening? What? Who? Who am I fighting? Oh, wait a minute. Formless Faint. Wow. Okay. It is fast. You there. Halt. Brant, relax. He was following me. He tried to give me money. I refused, and then he attacked. Shit. We're in for it now. Did I just get thrown in jail? He is an agent dispatched from Batal. Pray, let us handle the rest. We will hear all he has to say before the week is out. I bid you, wait till then. Hmm. Yes, sir. What's uh what's on your desk here? Can I read that? We shall see how bold you are in irons. Can I hop on your table and, and read it now? 
regarding the oath. I believe, yeah, I already read that. Because that's when I was interrogated by Brett. Well, interrogated air quotes around that. Okay, well, that was cool. I was right. It was that person. I just, you know, let them go the first time. But I mean, can you blame me? He just, he just said harumph and just left it at that. Oh, rift crystals. Nice. <laughs> oh, just rip all the plants off. Sure, why not? Are you talking to a random door? All right. Now we were going to try and look for a wake stone shard. Yeah, but that's locked. Is there... Oh, is it right there? It is indeed. Okay. That is a cool little item, though. Just telling you where the wake stone shards are. Trying to get over to Walter's Tavern. It's over to the east from here, but think maybe I have to follow this wall. Mildred, I'm not ready yet. <laughs> you need to have some patience. Oh, sorry. Someone's house. Someone's house. There we go. This ought to bring me there. Yeah. Maybe? Okay, this is definitely the slums. I don't know what to do. About what? What to do? What to do? What's wrong, Daphne? I've no mother or father to speak of, you see. So the nice people at the Gracious Hand take care of me. I wanted to get them a present to say thank you. And I thought a bunch of flowers would be just the thing. The problem is, I can't seem to find any good ones. Do you think you could help me? All I need is a bunch of pretty flowers. For true. Thank you ever so much, Arisen. I'm sure you'll find the prettiest flowers that ever were. I have a bunch of flowers, I think, in my storage. Hmm. Is this the way to the tavern? It is. Alright. Just, just curious to see if there's anyone, um, anyone here might know more about the beggar, but there's a lot of folks here. Well met. This here is the sanctuary of tipplers and merrymakers alike. I assume you'll be starting off with a mug of the good stuff. Keep those orders coming. This fearsome world of ours is... You know, let's buy a round. Everyone in the slums. Not half bad. This is for you, Master. I thought it might come in useful. See? Now that was money well spent. I mean, it probably wasn't because no one seems to care, but now I just steal from him anyway. Oh, right. What? Pray tell is back here? Oh, I'm, I'm out of the capital. Okay, let's head back. I want to go check my storage. I want to see if I have flowers. Your feet. You run too fast for the likes of me. No time to catch your breath. Try to keep up. That person just evaporated. We'll figure the the beggar thing out eventually. Is there something on the floor by you? Oh, something to read? Did I read this already? 
Yes. Yes, I did read that. This ladder can take us to new heights. Yes, that's what ladders do. All right, Mildred, still don't have your coin. In fact, I have much, much less of it because I've been buying drinks around the town. All right, pardon me, excuse me. Uh, nope, this is the vocation guild. Here we go. Good evening, sir. Uh, nope, not gonna rest. We're going to withdraw, possibly. I know those are dried flowers. Bunch of flowers. There we go. It's on the roads, despite the hour. Much obliged. This just seems like you know the right thing to do. Well, this simplifies things. Our task is nearly done. Perhaps once we've I know not much has happened we might allow ourselves in this episode, but uh, you know, you are correct. it will hopefully, probably. Daphne. Hoy arisen. Have you brought me a bunch? Oh, just look at them. They're the most beautiful flowers I've ever seen. <laughs> These should brighten the sisters' days. Say. Would you mind terribly if I asked you another favor? See, one of my friends taught me a magic spell. It's supposed to let you meet whomever you like. All you have to do is find a silver stone, put it under your pillow, and say the magic words. But there's the problem. I've been looking all over for such a stone, and I can't find one anywhere. Would you find a silver stone and bring it to me, Arisen? Is the silver stone just silver ore? For true. I knew I could count on you, Arisen. I'll be waiting. Our next mission is to acquire a silver stone. I have silver ore, and now I need to go get it. Unless... We can purchase it or mine it up ourselves. I don't have any... Uh, no, I would have deposited it all. Oh, wait. You found some silver ore... I did? Is it is it really on my person? Never mind. That is fortuitous. Oh, I can't find a silver stone any. Cool. I had three. Just look how it shines. Thank you ever so much. Say, aren't you curious who I want to meet? Well, I'll tell you. My mother and father. I don't even know what they look like, you know. Not to say I'm unhappy at the gracious hand, of course. But I'd really like to meet them, even just once. I want to tell them how grateful I am that they gave me life. Oh, it's so shiny. Oh, hi, Arisen. You'll help me again if I need it, won't you? Please say yes. I'm a habitual quest taker on her. Miss Daphne seemed pleased with our efforts. Mayhap we ought to pay her another visit sometime soon. Yeah, we will. We will. Uh, I, I want to go out and do some sort of adventure, but it seems like the next thing we got to do is not the gift of giving, but rather unsettling encounter? Yes. Yep, yeah, this one is almost certainly going to be innocuous and kind of boring. And unfortunately, they're just not handling these really, what could be very cool quests. They're not handling them all that, all that well. In my opinion, in my opinion, the Thieves one in the Nameless Village was actually pretty cool. I would appreciate your... You are the Arisen, yes? Sonia, we've, we've done this before. Follow me. Look, just make me get a disguise. Follow me. What we're going to do is we're going to run right up past all the guards. Okay? And that's it. That's the plan. That's what I've come up with. 60% of the time it works every time. And here's where I should be caught. 
Here's where I should be caught. That guy should catch me. Tis best you move along. Should one of the other guards spy you? Yeah, yeah. I've already been in here. I've already looted it. What do we have here? Writings of a soldier on duty. I cannot help but think it is strange. Pawns used to loiter about the Riftstone in droves, but I've not seen a single one for some time now. It is difficult to imagine where they might have gone. I wonder if this bears reporting. I still see pawns. As it should be. It is no concern of ours. I'll hear no more of this tittle tattle. Thank you. Focus on the task at hand. What's the task at hand? Is it is the task leaving? Oh, yep, but coming this way. <laughs> Maybe I wasn't supposed to go in here anyway. I just get moot. I just got moot at. All right, that won't open. Sorry, I know shouldn't really steal from these memorial areas, but hear me out. I wanted it. Is there a way up? No. Well, I can go back in the guardhouse. Somehow not down here. Alright, they've left this post. That is fortunate. Boy, but I need to go. Oh, thought I just saw someone. Nope, just light. Should I go down? Is this just a different part of the guardhouse? But that's just outside. That, did I just do a silly little loop? Is it even connected? Alright, maybe. Alright, so we're gonna go up. Oh, but we can't go that way. Unless maybe we go down and then we can? Sure's not looking like it. Then again. Ah. Oh, that's a lot of... Oh, it's a masquerade. Do, am, I, am I fitting in? Am I blending in? Mm-hmm. Look at that candelabra. Beautiful. Exquisite, really. You shan't be allowed to attend the masquerade. Oh, that I wouldn't. House, I would I would never even think of it. 
It's preposterous, really. These cards couldn't care less. Oh, come on. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, I didn't think so. I didn't. Wasn't gonna. But at the same time, I was thinking about it. Wait, how do I. How do I get in? I mean, I've been in the audience chamber before. Oh, maybe the kitchens. Like, if I go up here... Oh, you're just watching. Hmm. What if I just go quietly like this? Oh, no, you don't. I wasn't... No, you misunderstood. I was checking on your torch. You know, building code says torches should be six feet away from any wooden doorway. So, uh, that's going in my notebook there, friend. Oi, I, you can't come in here. who would even think of that? That's ridiculous. All right, but seriously, where, where am I supposed to be going in, huh? It feels like Sonya led me to What business have you here? Hold on. I mean, this seems stupid, but I've done dumber things. The marcher set, okay. And a Seeker's Token? Sure! Yeah, that Marcher set, we've actually already gotten a set of that, and it's, uh... It's really bad. Just, just truly terrible. Still worth it. So far, me killing those rats are the only combat this, uh, this episode has seen. And for that, I am sorry. That's not true. We did beat up Bermudo. What about this guardhouse right here? Just kidding. So it's just got to be the one that Sonya brought me to, which was... I'll be honest, I don't know. It was this way. And then it was over, over here. So, okay. This is, this is what we do. Yep, go ahead and act like this is a big deal. I mean, we did use this to get into the main chamber before. Obviously, I'm just getting turned around. But I was just here. This did not lead where I wanted it to. Alright, no one, no one cares. But this will just spit me out. This will just spit me on the courtyard. Right? And you're going to say, hey, don't go in there looking like that. Yeah, what? What am I doing wrong? Again. Oh. 
Oh, maybe it's maybe it's the wrong guardhouse. Maybe I was going in here. All right, let's try turning around. Sorry, pardon me. That doesn't open. I mean, it really does seem like the one that Sonya opens up is the only one that opens. I mean, it makes sense. Brant said specifically that he would have that open at night. So where? Satellite tower? Probably not, because this is going to go way too high. Although it's heading in the right direction. Very much the right direction. Okay. We're rolling with this then. presume to know my lord however it must be a highly sensitive matter for the regent kin to request a private audience oh perhaps the boy has finally grown wise to the benefits my favor can bring he might just be his mother's puppet but at least he knows what's good for him M my lord if someone were to overhear Oh, unring your hands, you fool. As if anyone in this palace would dare say a word against me. Now, if Wilhelmina calls, tell her to await me in my chambers. I will return presently. What are you doing in here? I don't recognize I don't recognize me either. You don't have to do that. Nothing to seize. We're leaving. We're leaving. I'm going to get thrown in jail. Shh. Hide with the broom. You're one with the broom. Did they actually give up? Well, I probably should stay away for a bit longer. Mm -hmm -hmm. Come on, go back. Uh-oh. Dude, guards. I don't want to fight my way through. I feel like that won't end well for... Okay, definitely me. Oh, did they stop? He did. Alright. Well then, let's loot this. Iron shields, good. Needed that. What if it's too early for dinner? That's a valid qu You're going to go back up the tower? Oh, you are. Oh, but you're going to be so slow about it. Uh, you haven't gone anywhere to... Mm, should I turn my lantern off? Will that make a difference? What if I run past you? Lantern off. One of you. One of you. One of you. Okay. 
This game has been getting a lot of praise for its AI with its NPCs. I'm going to have to go ahead and knock it down a few points for what I just did. Because that was a bit silly. But hey, it works in my favor. Lantern on. Allard, are you gone? Ha, you fool. Now what, pray tell, are you hiding other than an Elder Scroll? Uh-oh. There's nothing here? Is this a large room? <gasps> okay. It says, make the most of the minister's absence to conduct a search of his chambers. I'm in his chambers. And I can't investigate anything. Which means I may have screwed up by getting caught, but I didn't actually get caught. Although. Oh, could I really have just done this? Well, no, because there's no way. I don't think there's any way of getting to the window. I mean, I guess I could check other rooms. Perhaps. Yeah, the magistrate's office. A historic account in Vermont, the one with the power to overcome the dragon, known as the Arisen, is enthroned as sovereign. While in Batal, the protection of the Lambert Flame is held as absolute, believed to prevent the advent of calamity. Curiously, the two nations are at odds regarding pawns. Those crossers of the rift in Vermont, they are deemed faithful attendants of the sovereign, while in Batal, they are viewed are viewed as harbingers of misfortune. I'm worried that I just bugged the quest by not getting caught. Hmm. I could take the watchtower elevator up. There probably should be guards in the watchtower. Ah, oh, no. I, I do. I think I... I think I goofed it. I think I goofed it. Because it's, it's probably this. It's probably this scroll right here. But there is absolutely nothing to investigate. I think maybe what I ought to do is actually go get caught by a guard, thrown in jail. I have a key. And then try this again. Hopefully I'm able to try it again. I hear some voices. Hey. I'm a tad preoccupied just now, if you can't tell. With what? What? Uh, you're just going to attack? Oh! Hold the phone! We, we don't do jail here? Well, this is, uh, they give up very easily. I'm concerned as to the state of things right now. And I think what I have to do is leave and try again tomorrow night. Uh, yeah, so let's do that. I will go ahead and pause the recording here. I'll go spend some time. Let's see if we can't give it another go.
Well, I slept till evening. The quest is still marked here, so back in the satellite tower. I don't know if I'm going to get the cutscene again. Stop hopping. I also don't know if I wait, if the guard is going to spot me anyway. Oh, but wait a minute. Is that... Can I get to that ledge? Ooh, interesting. I don't get the cutscene a second time. But there's still no change. Oh, no. I mean, this has to be right. Oh, this is so bad. I couldn't have just messed it up that badly, right? Oh, okay. I mean, I'll take I'll take a chest. Ooh. Some quartzly gear. Castle offices, can't get in. The royal chambers? I can just walk into the royal chamber. Is this where the wakestone chart is in this chest? Yes, it is. Hmm. What has happened? Good, I can walk right into Deesa's bedroom. No one minds. I don't suppose there's any way to abandon a quest, is there, either? I haven't seen any. Yep, this is a problem. And I'm going to have to look into this. I'm not sure what else I can do. Is there something very obvious that I'm missing? There's no examine anywhere. I mean, I could just wait out here and see if he comes back and I could just listen. Okay. I'll just admit it, I had to look this up. Because I looked all over, and nothing happened. I even reset it again by spending another night, and nothing happened. And it's because, apparently, and it it does stand out, this right here is a door. So it's not that I broke it, it's simply that there is a fake room. Batali Crested Letter. What does it say? It bears a crest that looks to be of Batali origin. Best you delivered it to Captain Brand. Yes. Well, uh-oh. Surely none more important than this. I speak of the ascension of the Sovereign. Indeed. But that, Your Grace, would be better discussed in the presence of your mother. I should probably hop out the window now. Because they were right outside the door. Where can I get down safely? Oh. Right onto these cloth wagons. Perfect. And then we just run. Okay. Uh, that was... Honestly, I'm not... Well, well. Going to say anything else. Yours isn't a face I'm accustomed to seeing around the palace. How did you get in here? Stealth? Cunning? Raking AI? Oi! 
Oi! Who goes there? Who's there? Tut, tut. Now, this just won't do. How's a lady supposed to work with all these interruptions? Oh, it is you, Lady Wilhelmina. Mm-hmm. Do excuse us. We thought to enjoy a little fresh air. Though, we had hoped for slightly more privacy, if you catch my meaning. Apologies, my lady. But might I ask the name of your companion? Are you sure it would be wise? Such knowledge has been known to cost a man his head. Ah, understood, my lady. If anyone asks, I shall say I saw naught. Hmm. A narrow escape. You should count yourself lucky that he was so easily lusted. I don't appreciate having my motives questioned. I did as I saw fit. Need I say more? Still, you are welcome to come calling, should the fancy take you, and should you have the gold for it. Well, thank you, Wilhelmina. And I just got... Mermacolian? 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 An establishment also known as the Rose Chateau. Grants a bare entry to the border. Ah, okay. That'll be uh, useful. All right, now we're free to just run. I think. Mostly. All right, well, let's go turn this into print. So this entire episode, really nothing happened. Nothing adventurous, which is a shame. But we just had a lot of errands to run. And such is the nature of an, an RPG like this. I'm not going to make apologies for it. Because I did say at the start of this Let's Play, this is going to be a long form. I'm going to be taking my time and taking it all in and apparently struggling a lot more than I thought I would with the... Regarding the false sovereign. Figuring out the quests. Um, I don't know what discovery I made about the false sovereign. All I know is that um, I have a letter. With a crest of uh, Batali. Or Batal, I guess. Nope, always get the wrong entrance. All right, let's turn this into Brant, see if we can make this jump. Now we just run up here. And that's where we're going to call it apart. There is much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. I know this sigil well. Tis the crest of the neighboring country of Batal, a land with which Vermin has no official dealings at present. Let me see. It reads... True to our word, we offer you the power of the Godsway. Pray make haste in securing Melv, that all might be made ready ere our plans are set in motion. A meager clue, to be certain. Though, tis clear that the Queen Regent conspires with Batal. This does not bode well at all. Though the political situation is stable at present, much blood has been spilt between Vermund and his neighbor in the past. I fear such a partnership would only portend the drawing of more. At any rate, to seem our search has led us to only more questions. Chief among them, what is meant by securing Melv and this God's way? I will investigate these matters as best I can. In the interim, Your Majesty, should you have time to spare, might you make for Melv? Only once we have gleaned a fragment of the Queen Regent's plot. Can we begin to thwart it? And ere it slips my mind, pray, take this. Perchance it will help speed you on your way to Melv. Queen Regent Dixon, Ooh, ring of a cruel 5,500 gold? Fellow, but what precisely is their aim? Right, and what is that ring for? Slightly increases the maximum amount of weight that the wearer can carry. How much, mind you? Okay, it's not terrible. 
and that might actually help me versus ring of tenacity which just gives me more stamina but if if i am put into a higher kind of weight class or equip load class it really slows me down anyway wait a second wait a second what what is the quest that just got set as a uh Return to Captain Bright and hear the findings of the investigation. Wait a few days. Oh, but it's wait a few days. Right, right, right. I forgot. I forgot. He was going to be interrogating uh, Bermundo. At any rate, it's late. I've been playing for a while. It. I had some major, major tech issues that I had to solve just to be able to play tonight. And uh, as such, it is well past 1 a.m., I'm going to be calling it a night, which means I'm going to be calling it a part there. So thank you everyone so much for watching. Hope you're still enjoying and I'll see you next time.